Ants make up 20% of the Earth, practice slavery, and can operate as a superorganism. Those are not lies. There are so many ants on Earth that their mass accounts for roughly 20% of all biomass on Earth. But how could an animal so tiny add up to that significant of a portion of Earth's living organism weight? There are roughly 1 million billion ants on Earth, and some of them can get pretty big. Ants are as old as the dinosaurs, first arising about 120 million years ago, and they've already survived mass extinction events, such as the Cretaceous Paleogene extinction event roughly 65 million years ago, which killed the dinosaurs. Ants have been around forever, and in that time have essentially spread to every nook and cranny across the globe. With the exception of Antarctica, every piece of land on Earth has some form of native ants and a number of invasive species of ants. In fact, ants are so powerful that the Argentine ant has conquered six continents by traveling on vessels and in baggage. Scientists estimate that 1 million billion ants are alive today, or a one with 15 zeros behind it. The even scarier part is that ants have a hive mind, meaning that when ants come together, they can work together to form one organism that moves and conquers prey and obstacles together. Ant colonies are referred to as superorganisms and together have impressive capabilities. All of this is scary, and when ants make up an average of 20% of the Earth's biomass due to their sheer numbers, their ability to operate as a superorganism becomes even scarier. In certain regions where ants are more populous, they can even account for upwards of 25% or more of the local biomass. If you're not scared of ants yet, there's one final fact you should know. Ants practice slavery. At least, certain ant species are known to raid neighboring colonies and forcibly acquire young to either be eaten or put to work in their own colony. Ants have their own slave ants. So, ants make up roughly 20% of organism mass on Earth, can operate as a superorganism, and practice slavery. <laughs>